the channel. As you've seen previously, we have bought four palettes of Amazon Returns and this is palette number one. This palette contained of a overly full big box and loads of little boxes and semi medium sized boxes. Um, on the first instance, I wasn't particularly happy because big one big box with a lot of small stuff means there is could be a lot of toot inside if we've done the video similar to this before we had a lot of like a chinesey stuff um items inside but anyway without further ado i think let's have a look um it did arrive literally uh, when we picked it up it was a big box there was a palette wrapped with some other bits on the bottom so hence this box is overly full um i'll start with the first thing right on the top and i think this is a fish tank, like a mini aquarium, and I love this. I really wanted one for ages. Our little girl is obsessed with like fish, so um, I think I will be keeping that one. I had a um, had a quick look before on the fish tanks because this one has the lights and the little filter. Everything is included. I believe that this kind of that site selling for about forty eight pounds on Amazon. Um, it doesn't have a box. It might have fell out somewhere in the bottom I don't know but it looks like it's all new and all the bits inside are also new which is great so I shall be having a look and probably will be keeping this one so excuse me I'm just gonna put it down for I'm gonna literally pick bits from the top um we have a look like a grater again this is like a Chinese thing again all the Chinese things recently it's all brand new um, Chinese things, although being some of them really rubbish, they have actually increased in price a lot, especially on Amazon. I'm not really sure what's happening, but well, I do know what's happening, but that's <laughs> thing for another video anyway. But yes, the, even the Chinese things um, now seem to be cost a little bit more, like everything else. So feel greater. I would say those kind of things between seven ninety nine and ten pounds to go. All right, we have a box of Osram LED lights. Uh, Little ones like that. Again, looks like they are brand new. Oh, okay, I see the reason if it's been returned. One of them has unclipped the clip somewhere there. Um, light bulbs nowadays don't really cost a lot, but it's Osram, so it might probably warrant a maybe £10 for the £10 pack. So that's okay. And just to let you know, guys, we have paid just over £200 for this palette. So here we are. See, this is not returned. There's just, just Amazon stuff. This is a, a massage mat. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Why is that going to massage? It looks like I might have to sit on that. Oh yeah, it is, isn't it? <laughs> if it's there. Oh my goodness. You want to massage your bum? Oh, wonderful, that's, that's great. Yeah, that's, um, yeah. That's not going anywhere. For uh, for all you wondering, because uh, we now obviously shared the link with our uh, one of our small eBay shops and allocated this to the YouTube. Um, we have been doing bundles before with stuff like little stuff that I just not be selling individually. So keep an eye on below, link below on the eBay shop. I will be listing probably if there's a lot of small stuff. I'll be making the bundles. You'll know exactly what's in them. So anyway, I shall continue. So we have a bag and it says... Westminster paper wrap A3. Okay, I think it's like a card. Oh, it's a frame. It's a frame. Sorry, I'm not going to open it. I'll be there all day. It's basically a basic picture frame. Again, like a boot sale material. <laughs> we have what looks like a clock. I lost oh, scissors. Hold on. Uh, I don't like clocks neither. They don't worth a lot. Wash that in there. That's quite funky though. And it looks like it's new, so I know that has some damage on there on the wood. It looks pretty cool though, but yeah, a little damage in there where the wood is chipped off, so each. Okay, right, I'm going on the floor. Oh goodness, looks like we have Christmas lights. They're still wrapped in the bag. Again, not something I'm looking to sell individually, but... I might keep some for ourselves, depending on the size. Let's chuck that downstairs. Okay, looks... Hold on. Right. A kettle. This is the Amazon Basic stainless steel. I have to check it if it's new. It looks like it's not been touched. So, Amazon Basic stuff, I wouldn't imagine be worth any more than 10 quid for the kettle. So, it goes... We have... Oh, here we go. We've got a hoover, I think. Yeah. Okay. Quite you little dinky one. Look, uh, this one is mm, Vitronics. Wonderful. Uh, all the attachments look like they're still in the bags. 
It's still sealed, so I'll say it is brand new. Obviously, I will open it and have a look. But again, because it's not a particular brand, I would imagine those kind of things will go for like 20 or 30 pounds. So, okay. Right, let's start with, we have a children's toy, a little kitty ones. Uh, again, those kind of things, kids' toddlers toys like that, not really worth. They're probably, again, 7 99 to £10 pounds in the shop, so it's irritating to pack and send, but here we are. I have it. We have some more string lights. Oh, white. Okay. Again, brand new. Don't forget all of that stuff is still... Um, obviously has a value so 480 LED lights again I'll probably say if you were to buy them in the shop or on Amazon that'd be like 15 quid for a box like that whilst I'm here bending down we have had one of those we had this on the one of the other palettes before it's a lock steering wheel lock if people still use them well clearly they do um, have a look see if it's new okay it's got the key with it, so it looks okay. It's hard to tell whether it has been used or not, because it's immaculate, so I assume, yeah, it's new. Uh, those things are, I think, £49 on Amazon, obviously eBay, probably a tad cheaper, but they do sell okay, so I'm going to put that in there. The box is a bit trashed. Okay, while I'm there as well, put that in there, we have one of those. Uh... Let me have me. Uh, we have a iron, a Russell Hobbs iron. The box is ripped, but yeah, it's brand new. That's good. You see that? Hopefully, so yeah, brand new is still in pack. So I wouldn't even bother probably getting this one out, or will do. I don't know. I have to double check, of course. Anyway, so the Russell Hobbs, I think that's like one of the latest, fairly latest models. So I'm looking at probably about 45, 40, 45 pounds on that one. Providing it's obviously 100% new and works. Right. We also have that, but uh, this is one of the OXO containers, like plastic ones for storage. But this one's missing lid, unless it's somewhere else, so it's pretty much deemed useless, really. So here it goes. We have Tony and Guy hair, hair crimper, I think. It looks like it's never been taken out of box. Box is a bit damaged, but that's not a big deal. Again, anything like that is like 15, 15 quid probably. So easy sell. Oh, we have, again, hmm, a breast pump. Wonderful. Again, I wouldn't imagine it holds much value. So dump it aside. Uh, some cups. Oh, good Star Wars. Look. Could that be worth a little bit for the Star Wars fans? I'll put a tenner on it, maybe, on the floor. Oh, let's see, we've got something Breville bear with me. Okay. We have a Breville kettle. I know they do like to overcharge for those designs, kettles that have like lines or squares or whatever. And I think they're charging about 40 quid. Whether they're worth this or not is a different matter, but again, still in the wrapper. It doesn't look like it's been taken out. It's good. Box is a bit squashed, but not a big deal. Come on, bro, we'll get in. Okay, that's good. So, oh yes, we have a set of knives and a carving, carving fork and a sharpener. Yes, Sabatier is fairly pricey, I believe. Uh, and those set of three knives cost like £60. I think because I've got knife and sharpener and whatever, I think that's probably about 44 sorry, <laughs> 45 to £50 pounds worth. But because you can't sell knives on eBay, I think I'll be keeping that anyway. So here we are. Uh, we have... Oh my God. That looks like a... <laughs> a... I think this is a toilet brush holder. There am I to open that. Nah, so off it goes. It looks new though anyway, but hey. Uh, oh. Mop thing. Spray mop. Again, that's probably only worth like a fiver. Uh, be the Chinese brand. We have two pack shaped pillow. In the pillowcases there, I think. A night zone. Again, like that's just the basic cheap. Oh yeah, that maternity pillow covers thing again, worth like seven quid, whatever. 
Bye. Uh, we have, ooh, that's me in. Garden furniture cover, table cover. Okay, again, mm, yeah. It still be worth, don't get me wrong. Like if you do do boot sales, that'd be worth, I don't know, maybe five, but we don't do boot sales. I just bundle this up and off it ship. Maybe to one of you soon, who knows? Right, okay, we have Amazon Basics, aluminum tripod. Okay, the, the ones that we're filming on. So again, they're probably about 10 as well. Stay. Oh, let's have got bigger boxes. What do we have? Oh, we've got Henry bags. Tenner, easy tenner, they always sell. We have oh, some soap and glory, little gift set again. That'd be worth like five quid. We have, oh, some bigger boxes they look. We have Draper, foot pump. Uh, again, oh, still sealed. The Draper stuff is one of those sort of basic brands. I think we're looking about 20 pounds for a foot pump. Under two kilos, maybe go to Royal Mail. That's okay. I have oh, oh yeah, have some crystal glasses. <laughs> Dartington crystal. Normally the crystal wine glass is worth about twenty pound for a set. Let's see if it's broken. Oh no, there might be some. My goodness, in the bottom of the palette, and they're in one piece. They're quite cute. And there's another one there. Hopefully it's okay. It's all adding up now, isn't it, considering this is not over that bad. For a couple hundred quid, we're already there, aren't we? We're already in profit. I've got nowhere to put that. Sorry, guys. <laughs> right, I have stainless steel vacuum cup, some wrapping paper, and tissue paper. I have collapsible dog bowl. Again, that'd be worth like five pounds. Some bin bags. I know, aprons probably. Yeah, singles, aprons, again, not really worth. We we'll have Philips. Oh my goodness, where has that been? Through the walls. Philips, lady shaver. Um, yeah, if it's okay, that may be 20 quid if they are, like if it's brand new. Otherwise, it's a bin job. So far, so good. <sighs> I'm going now. <laughs> right, okay, I'll be there. Right, yes, another box of crystal. Sound okay? I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna open that. But sounds all right. Doesn't sound broken, that's the main thing. Right, we have a quiet bathroom clock. Quiet bathroom clock. Why do you need quiet clock for your bathroom? And this is for children. It's a foamy buff clock. Weird. Okay. I don't know. Again, not something I'd probably be interested to sell unless one of you guys want it, let me know. And I'll list it. We have some sponge. How I see they're doing a sponge take. So it's extra, extra absorbent things. Again, I've no idea on the value. That looks like a new product somebody of... Uh, created so anyway maybe there's a sponge in there as well so i don't know 10 quid for the lot maybe oh we've got some christmas bubbles again done really me butel special we have kitchen craft salad spinner again they're worth no more than a tenner if people if people still use them we have <laughs> brown bags we have Cafeteria, the little one again. It's a German make, so it should be worth about tenner. Some nappy bags. Oh, oh. That looks like one of those balcony screening things. Yeah, two piece plastic leaf camouflage. Again, probably still be worth a tenner. Uh, we have empty boxes, we have some bedding. Again, bedding sells well if you knock them out for like ten or for the double. Is it double? Yeah, ten quid for you buy. It sells well. That looks like some more Christmas lights or something. Yeah, some more outdoor lights, but no box. So, right. Let me see what else is that interesting. And we have some punch board. 
okay, to do some holes. And we've got some baby dummies. Again, that's just boot sale specials anyway. And then we've just got some absolute, not say to it, but just little things like Halloween decorations and baby bottles and drinking bottles. You basically get the idea. So basically all our money so far are in those items here that are worth that. And I will tell you, we have, I forgot to get this in, there was a Keta um, balcony furniture. It's a set of two chairs and a table. And the cheapest I've seen is it's £100 on eBay with a collection. But any other person selling for about 165 to £200. So it's out there. Sorry, I forgot to get this in. And this is the bag. Again, the stuff that was stacked loosely on the pallet. So we also have a men's shoe. That looks pretty cool, but... It's a Chinese brand, so be a branded one and be worth more, but I would imagine maybe £20. Lucky. We have some Philips Hue bulbs. Again, they were, should be worth £15 to £20. They're smart bulbs. Uh, oh, we've got some more Philips Hue. I've paid this out last year. We bought some of they, and I think I paid like 46 quid for two, so I think the prices have probably gone down quite a bit now, but still should be, I would think, 25 for those. We have... Merry Christmas, whatever this is. I'll say string lights, so some more Chinese Christmas lights. Uh, we have the Shiatsu Massager. Again, this is Victor. Um, I don't know the brand, so it's either Chinese brand or German brand. I don't know. I'll put £20 on that one. It looks like it's not even been opened, so it looks pretty good. Right. We have... A bottom cafeteria, French press, let's see if it's new out of interest. The box looks a bit beaten up, but it's there and it's not broken. Yeah, it's cute. Quite often glass items do break on the palette, but that one's all right. So good. Oh, we have a, yes, Le Creuset oven dish. The only trouble is when we're offloading the palette, um, because the box was like opened up like this. This thing was on the top and it slipped and it's got scratched. So whoops, I guess I'll be living in my kitchen. So I put it there for now, but yes, they are 25 pounds and it was new until I dropped it. So here we are. And just a couple more items left in there. We have a die cutting and embossing machine. Uh, I think they're probably worth, I don't know, take a guess, 20 pounds. Uh, two more. Mm. Amazon Basic microfiber duvet set. That grey. Okay. Uh, for some reason, right? We had that before with Amazon. The Amazon Basics. We had the duvet from them. And it said duvet. And then they list you all the sizes, right? Of what it is that they do. But you never bloody know which size is actually inside the box. Because it just doesn't tell you. It comes in the bag, right? Yeah, go figure. Which size is that for without opening it up. So... There is going to go into my bundles, and one of you can open it and you let me know. <laughs> Hold on. Uh, right. Get in. Right. And the last one in there. We have something. One house. They normally do like kitchen bits. Let's have a look. It doesn't look like it's been unsealed. Until now. Uh, it's, I think something's missing from that because we have a two power cables and that so and a bag I don't know what it was clearly it has been opened it's just like another cable inside the plug another plug okay I guess it has been opened and somebody decided to help themselves to something and then send the remainders back wonderful great people thanks very much Right, a few boxes would have whatever that is. Okay, that looks like LED light. I think that sounds very cheap. Yes, I think it's light. Uh, I think it's been clearly been taken out, so whatever reason, I wouldn't think I'd want to hang a nice Chinese lamp. Right, okay, we have. Uh, refrigerator organizer. Right, 
this is the one box that says got six of them in there. We have some, which I'll pick up in a minute, the Amazon Basics ones. We have six of them individually boxed and they are worth, I think, £11 on Amazon. I would take guess because I've got six in there, so let's call it 50 quid for the pack we had. Okay. We ha also, <clears throat> there'll be something for me, a garden clutch to cover your little plants and seedlings when you plant them outside with some plant labels. They'll be up my street, so I shall be keeping this. We also have a Russell Hobbs quiet boil kettle. Okay. Only got slight damage to the box. Uh, looks brand new, looks like it's not been taken out. So, again, I'll put Russell Hobbs, I put maybe 20, 25 pounds on that one. I'll show you. Oh, yeah, this is the. It was the Amazon. Yeah, Amazon Basic uh, Fridge Bins. Oh, yeah, so it's two pack, it's medium. We have six boxes of them, I believe four or six I didn't get them all in because it wasn't a point so I'll put two pack I'll put them I don't know I'll put 15 quid on that for to put them on eBay and I have a box of something excuse me been down there oh. it's fragile it's trashed for that one hold on oh I think it's picture frames don't particularly like break picture frames they just normally don't really get anywhere in one piece. Stay. They're cute though. Here we are. There's a few in there. I Again, whether they're selling them on eBay, I'm not so sure. Um, I would imagine this, the whole set of them is a five there. It's got to be worth at least 15 quid anyway. So, and I think, guys, this is it from this palette. It wasn't like the biggest palette, as you could tell, but... That the Keta furniture um, has taken quite a big chunk of the base of the palette because it's a really big box. So to recap, they're really for just over two hundred pounds. And considering if the Keta one retails at two hundred pounds, and we've got you know forty quid here, forty quid there, twenty quid there, um, that's a pretty good deal. So anyway, well, hope you guys enjoyed the video. Thank you for watching, and the video number two will come in soon. Bye bye.